In this video, I am demonstrating how to create the Java application. In this Java application, two different formatted text fields are used. The name. In name, we can easily enter any alphabets, but we can't enter any special character or numerical values. Similarly, if we go to H and try to enter any special character or any alphabets, we cannot enter any input. We can only enter any numerical values or any positive values. And from JTA combo box, we can also select different values. And clicking on submit button, pop up window will be result the all values of our input data. For creating this project, go to the file section or click on create new project or you can also click on this button for creating the new project click on the next button and give name to your project uncheck mark the create main class and click on finish button now go to the source package and right click on the default package and create new JF form. I am going with default name and click on the finish button. Now go to the palette and drag a text field. Now go and go to the palette and drag a label. Select both of them and press Ctrl C and Ctrl V to make a duplicate. You can also make duplicate by right clicking on an element and select duplicate. Now go to the palette and drag a combo box. And now again go to the palette and select one button and drag it to the bottom of combo box. Now select all element of a layout and go to the property. And click on this button to change the front of all elements. Now select bold, size 18, and click OK. To change the text of label, left click on it, press F2, and enter your text. Similarly, change the label of edge. and also change the text of button now resize your text field and empty your text field by read text backspace and click enter button or clicking F2 backspace and enter button to preview how it looks click on the preview button and if you notice the item will be defined the combo box with the different items to change the item left click on the com combo box go to the properties and change the models the model are different type of item which separated by the column separated by the comma so declare different items Now, if you again see the preview, you will find the different value which enter by the model. Now, right click on the first text field and change variable name to name tf and click OK. Similarly, change the variable name of a text field to to edge tf and click ok now also change the variable name of combo box c b for making 
the text field is a formatted text field we using the key type event or the key event so go to the events and from key event select the type key typed in this method we are using the event which called key type this event gen generate a particular code whenever the any key is typed in a text field so we use we check every key which is typed in the range and if it is our particular case we are execute this event so taking the character which is store every key event or a key placed by event so type event which I already defined here dot get key character this function will be written the type character and store in the test character for checking type if one more braces and type character is you will find the different methods is alphabet if digit if uppercase is union white space space character lower case for this tutorial we are using the alphabet is alphabet we have to do something if it is alphabet so type character is alphabet so we have to don't do anything we have to just execute our event and if type character is not event then we have to consume this event or neglect this event type event consume or you can also read event consume the neglect our event for so consume event it will be not pursues the default event or the original event so in this text field we will define the event which will take all input a b c and this event only determine this event is value only if we go and run our project now and try to enter the alphabet and if we try to enter the numerical value no numerical value will be entered but if we try to enter space or backspace will be available Now similarly, go to the edge, go to the events, and set the event on key typed. Now just copy this value. And paste here. And change is alphabet to digit now it will be check all digits we can also set the different values or we can also check a particular key like if we want to also add the y as a year so we use test character equal to even dot we can and all different key like x we use y or lower y so all key put input are already available for this tutorial we don't need any extra events 
so this line will be check if event is a digit if not we can zoom the event now go to the design and set event on a button go to event action and set action performed now this changes value we have to use on proper message so type g option panel dot so message and set the root value to null and change this to double quotes name equals to plus now for taking the input from text field type j text field name tf dot get text and also apply plus double quotes slash and to change the line h equals to double quotes and for h type hda dot get text and double quotes and for taking the input from a combo box we have to use different method call selected or input so type combo box name so dot you can also take the input by or input item or you can also take different type of input methods so we use get selected item if we select the text so we will get the index value so so this concludes this video and thanks for watching